guys welcome back to my channel so today we're gonna talk about a new shoulder rest that I have been uh, playing with for a while using it for a while and testing it for you guys and yep as usual I just wanted to give you my thoughts so we're talking about a Viva La Musica shoulder rest so this shoulder rest came beautifully beautifully packaged I really have to say the presentation is an A plus so you have um, right up front you have design of two uh, picture of the two shoulder rests that are available two colors and then there is some ideas of how to move those legs and how to adjust and what you can actually do with this and then if you slide this package okay and then when you open up um, you have a little cloth which I don't really know what is it supposed to uh, do or I don't know it has obviously Viva uh, La Musica print on it but um, I don't know you're supposed to polish the shoulder wrist I don't know but um, okay so the cloth is here and then um, you have some instructions here which are, which are printed to the bottom of the box and some suggestions of how to adjust um, the shoulder wrist um, and then you have some more info right here. So the box, you know, the presentation, it's really, really beautiful. Um, here's another photo of the uh, shoulders. So I, I'm really, really impressed with the, with the presentation in the box. It comes with the two different finishing. You can get the one uh, in a light color as well as the one in the dark. Uh, I picked up the one in light. I thought it will just fit my violin nicer. It's actually very beautiful. I think it's um, really nicely made. I like, um, you know, the wood section here, the wooden section. Um, it's nice and smooth, and I like um, how they, you know, put like a high gloss. I don't know if you can see, um, like a very shine on it. And then you have the uh, Viva La Musica sign right here. So the shoulder rest has a very nice thick cushion um, right here as you can see um, it's much thicker than in your ordinary uh, shoulder rest um, so if you are someone who likes to have a little more protection and cushion this is probably a big plus as you can see the shape of the shoulder rest is slightly different than your uh, typical coon has some similar similarities but still is a little bit different um, it's also quite thick. The legs here, the rubber legs are actually very comfortable and they sit very nicely on the edge of the violin on both sides and I never had a problem with, you know, slipping off the violin or moving. They are actually very nicely made. What's different about this um, shoulder rest is the design of the, the legs and the fact that you can actually move them at different angles. So according to the Viva La Musica, you are supposed to adjust this legs at the 30 degree angle. This is what I just did right now. And uh, if you look at your box, all the instructions are going to be right here. This is the, uh, the first picture shows pretty much the position that they suggest. It's supposed to be universal for all the violinists and the most comfortable. Um, when I first tried this shoulder rest on and I did exactly what they wanted and I play in this particular position for, I don't know, maybe two or three days and I got a horrible blisters on my shoulder. Um, so that obviously didn't work for me. I went ahead and I made this, uh, you know, made his legs completely straight and the way you adjust, just going to show you guys, you're going to move this little screw just loose it up and see how these legs are just going to adjust. So you can go really any way you want. Obviously, that's not how you're going to play, but um, you, can go, you can go completely straight and then you just tighten up the screw and then you do exactly the same on the other side. Okay, so you loose it up, line it up straight and just tight it up. There we go. So when I moved to this position, I felt like it was much more comfortable. Uh, at least for me, but um, it wasn't still a hundred percent. 
I try to go 45 degrees and really kind of, you know, just play with this and use a different angle since it's quite adjustable, it still didn't work for me. So after about a month or so of trying and adjusting and playing on it, I pretty much gave up. Now, don't get me wrong because I know a lot of people who actually love that shoulder wrist. Um, shoulder wrist, in my opinion, is very personal. Um, you know piece of your equipment um, so I like the shoulders that are a little bit thinner and has a little bit more curved so this one as you see it's pretty flat it doesn't have much of a curve here when it goes over your shoulder and I think that's what was giving me the most discomfort so if you want you know if you are more into like more curvy shoulder rest, I think you this might not be uh, one for you if you're looking for a shoulder rest, that will give you a little bit more um, like a cushion and you know more support because you like to be more comfortable that's probably it's a really good shoulder rest. now you know this particular model I think it feels too thick and too bulky on my shoulder I don't know for some reason I always get the blisters when I use this shoulder rest. so um, I don't know maybe it's just me <laughs> But uh, anyway, um, it is a gorgeous shoulder wrist and you know, I, I, I don't want to say any negative part about this because I think it's a beautiful, beautifully made shoulder wrist and uh, it's just probably not for everybody. Here's a few close-ups on the legs and they are very comfortably, uh, you know, sitting on the, on the violin. I have no problem with this. Here's the side view. This shoulder rest is also very lightweight, so um, it might look like it's very heavy and bulky, but it's actually very light, well, very, um, doesn't give you much weight on the, on the violin, it, even though it's, you know, it's a wood, but it is very lightweight shoulder rest. So you can also very easy store the shoulder rest in your case, because those legs are collapsible. So I just fold it, as you can see nicely. And that easy fits in your any case that you're gonna have and then once you're ready to use it you just pull them up there we go so all right i hope you guys find this review helpful and i'll talk to you soon bye